This is the Keychron Q1 Pro Wireless. It's a readily available, customizable, and pre-built mechanical keyboard created for those of us desiring something more out of our typing experience. In this video, we're going to explore all the purchasable options available to this board, we'll get the full unboxing experience, we'll cover all the specs and capabilities, and then we'll wrap things up with a smooth sound test. Let's get into it. To begin, let's take a closer look at the options available to the Keychron Q1 Pro Wireless. There were three different packages available on their site. The barebone knobs sitting at $179, the assembled knobs special edition for $199, and the regular assembled knob edition also sitting at $199. So the special edition is available in shell white and carbon black colorways, and the only real difference is that it comes with exclusive all white and all black keycaps for more of an elegant look. The bare bone edition and the fully assembled board also come in a silver gray finish. It's kind of like a gunmetal. Now it's worth noting that the bare bone non package doesn't come with switches or keycaps. However, for just an additional 20 bucks, the assembled editions offer a set of KSA profile double shot PBT keycaps and your choice of Keychron K Pro switches. And if you're looking for even more customization, there are alternative backplates available which will drastically change the sound and feel of the keyboard. By default, you're going to get the polycarbonate plate, but there's also a brass plate that's $35, an FR4 plate sitting at $15, and an aluminum plate at $15 as well. Now, I do plan on ordering all of these plates to do a sound test to compare how they feel, so if you're interested in that type of content, definitely subscribe to the channel. So, with all those pricing options in mind, I did pick up a fully assembled carbon black keyboard with the K-Pro banana switches, and it was shipped to my door within 4 business days for $219, all said and done. Before moving on to the unboxing experience, I want to mention that Keychron actually did a great job shipping this over from China. It came in a weatherproof bag that had this really thick extra padding kind of encapsulating the keyboard to absorb any impact, which left me feeling at ease when I received it. But now getting inside the box, you'll find a variety of accessories and components. There's a quick start guide with an instruction sheet to help you get started. On the sheet, there's valuable information like how to connect to Bluetooth and what the keybinds are for controlling the RGB. You'll also receive a bag containing extra screws, gaskets, rubber feet, and tools. Then you'll also find a Keychron branded USB cable that actually has a USB-A converter for your convenience, so that's pretty nice. And the last thing that you're going to pull out of this box is the star of the show. It's your Q1 Pro wireless keyboard. Let's move on and talk about the specifications and capabilities of the Q1 Pro Wireless. The keyboard features a high build quality with a 6063 grade aluminum body that's undertaken 24 manufacturing processes and it weighs in at just under 4 pounds or 1,736 grams. It does incorporate a double gasket mounted design along with a polycarbonate plate by default which results in a seriously flexible and comfortable typing experience. To further enhance the overall sound profile, two layers of sound absorbing foam are strategically placed between the plate, PCB, and the bottom case. Connectivity wise, this Q1 Pro Wireless is truly innovative utilizing its Broadcom Bluetooth 5.1 driver that connects up to three devices simultaneously and it also has keybind profiles for both Mac and Windows. As noted in the quick start guide, it's incredibly intuitive to connect this keyboard to multiple devices. Simply open your Bluetooth settings in Windows and press add device. Remove the cable from the keyboard and flip the switch to BT, then simultaneously press and hold for about five seconds the function and number one keys. A blue light will then start blinking at you and you will notice the device is ready to be paired from within your Windows prompt. Then you can add a second device by pressing function plus the number two key and then repeat the same process mentioned previously using number two instead. I simply can't put into words how amazing this feature is because I've been using two keyboards while working from home for years. Now I can just use the one keyboard with the keybind swap between systems in seconds. As far as performance goes, the keyboard is equipped with an ARM Cortex M4 32-bit chip offering 1000Hz polling rate in wired mode and a 90Hz polling rate in wireless mode. It features a 4000mAh rechargeable lithium-ion polymer battery providing up to 300 hours of working time without the RGB enabled and around 100 hours with the RGB activated. Under the hood, we've got a hot swappable PCB with south-facing RGB lighting that offers a serious variety of color schemes. So far, my favorite RGB profile is this crazy keybind heat map that literally heats keys up and cools them down as it uses them intensely. It really makes for an epic lighting effect while gaming. And as mentioned while we were covering the purchasable options, Keychron does offer three switches with this keyboard which are paired with PCB mount stabilizers. 
The first of the switches is the K-Pro Red, which provides a linear feel with a 45 gram operating force and a 4 mm travel distance. If you prefer the tactile experience, you can opt in for the brown switch, which has a slightly heavier 50 gram operating force and the same 4 mm travel distance. And lastly, we have the banana switch, which also offers a tactile feel with a higher operating force of 57 grams and a shorter 3.3 mm travel distance. But sitting atop those switches will be the KSA Double Shot PBT keycaps, which are known for their durability and high profile spherical angle design. Additionally, it features a programmable knob, which by default controls volume up, volume down, and mute functions. Then on the second layer, the knob controls the RGB lighting. Now with the specs and capabilities covered, let's put the Keychron Q1 Pro Wireless to the test and see how it sounds. Wrapping up this review, I must say that my experience with the Keychron Q1 Pro Wireless has been fantastic. The build quality, customization options, and overall performance make it a solid choice for anyone seeking a high-end wireless mechanical keyboard. I do hope that this review has provided you with a good idea of what to expect when purchasing the Q1 Pro Wireless, so if you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, please let me know in the comments below. And thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.